Ah, let's try this again. Greetings, everyone. Welcome to one of the most uh, disorganized orgs in IGL. We have a matchup tonight, East Regional, Tier 1, Division 4. Between the 5 seed, BB United, and 12 seed, Beyond Tactics. Like our match earlier tonight, this is a regular season rematch. Uh, BB United, I believe, beat Beyond Tactics in four, in either week four or week five. So, you know, we have that. Let's uh, look at our bracket. So it's this matchup right here. Winner gets a 4 versus 13 match. Um, tail of the tape. So United finished 5 and 1 plus 8 in goal differential plus 7 in games. Cake at the top of the leaderboard. I forgot what the main three is. It might have been Cake, Cole, and Chirp. But all in all, like, you know, decent stat lines across the board. Sharp looks like he's been watching my personal streams with these uh, shots per game and the shooting percentage. Not really setting a team teammates for follow-up shots either. Like you compare that to cake. So on the other side of the pitch, Beyond Tactics, two and four. Minus six in goal differential, minus five in games. That's probably something to pay attention to. Because normally when, you know, you kind of run across teams like this just on the, you know, wrong side of 500, is generally there's a huge goal differential. So beyond tactics, keeping it close. Nice even split across the board. Io, um, kind of with these numbers, looks like they may have played one series, you know, three games. Um, but that's something you want um, from a sub is someone who can come in, give you a solid series. Better shooting percentages than United as well. Saw a bunch of high 20s on United. Beyond Tactics, right across, you know, across the board, keeping within each other. All right, so who's not, who's, who's night am I going to ruin with my prediction? Well, I'm going to ruin my orgs night. I do like United here, simply just based on kind of how the first series went between these two teams. Um, well, let's uh, find out, Kiffy. Now you're shooting 30. You got Chirp at 26. Actually, like, with the way Sh Chirp is spraying shots, that's like, you know, Ander levels of 
accuracy. Getting in my chirp digs now. Um, so yeah, back to my prediction. Yeah, I like United here. They won the first series around. Um, I think they need to be careful. Um, need to play clean. Um, beyond tactics, need to get United to panic and all that. So, and I mean, obviously, ta Beyond Tactics took a game off United last time. Um, so there's certainly no reason why they can't do it this time. And again, it's IGL playoffs. Fair warning to all the high seeds. Beware of those double-digit seeds. Like, some of them just say, we're playing for, with house money. We're just going to go out full throttle. And, you know, next thing you know, you have like a one seed going home in the first round. So, yeah. <laughs> um, should, be, should be an interesting matchup. So we had a matchup earlier. It was another rematch. Um, the Rats took on Alpha. Uh, the regular season match went four games. Playoff match, uh, unfortunately for Alpha, they got swept by BSR. So, I mean, you know, there's there's that for United. Like, you know, it doesn't have to go the, go the way of the first game. You know, they could sweep. But, you know, you have to, you have to respect your opponent. Um, you know, don't think you're going to walk all over them. So, you know, we'll, we'll, we'll see what happens. So using my my powers in the uh, BBA, BBU Discord, I believe the starting roster for United tonight will be uh, Cole, Chirp, and Kiffy. while we're waiting. We'll see when that matchup was. Okay, that was a week for a matchup. So it looks like it was Cole, Chirp, and Kiffy for United in that week for a matchup uh, against Reverb, Static, and Mitanchu. Beyond Tactics took game three. Q internal eye roll.
But Beyond Tactics came out and smashed BBU in that game three, six to two. Looks like other than that, then the series was even in goals. So. Beyond Tactics was also more accurate. So 6-4 in game one, 3-2 in game two, four mentioned 6-2 victory for Beyond Tactics in game three, and 5-4 in game four. So yeah, this Beyond Tactics team, like, you know, keeps it close. Um, you know, which, which again, explains their goal differential in the season. You know, for, you know, for two and 14 to only be minus six, like that is, that's not bad at all. And they basically went even in the series against uh, United the first time around. So... Guess we'll do a quick how they got here. Uh, week one, United one and four, beating Grey Nation. They one and five over Exploit Black. I was casted on uh, Jonas's channel. Beat Unity Esports in week three and five. Week four, the Beyond Tactics match. Lost to Sloth Sus in week five. That's a potential rematch uh, next round. Sloth Sus is the uh, four seed. And then United beat Purdue C in three. For Beyond Tactics, uh, they beat Purdue C in week one in five. Week two lost to Grey Nation in four. Got swept by Circuitry Gaming in week three. Circuitry Gaming franchise has some pretty good teams out there too. Um, week four lost to United in four. Week five uh, lost to Valiancy in five. Uh, and week six beat Exploit Black in four. Just kind of waiting on both teams, waiting on Cole to get his team in here and to pass the information along to the opponents. Friendly reminder, uh, IGL's 
winter circuit registration is live so if you want to get in head on over indiegamingleague.com go register welcome Sam's All right, call I'll remake. I'm not surprised that the lobby info is wrong. It took me like several tries to actually fire this game off. He's not working. Infos are correct now. Bane of all casters putting down the wrong lobby info. Or typoing the info. Even better. So Chirp, Cole, and Kiffy starting tonight for United. So United going to try and run it back with the same roster that they ran against Beyond Tactics in week four. It looks like we got Static, Reverb, and I.O. Come on, Kiffy, stop watching the stream and get it on your team. Here's our starting rosters. 5 versus 12 C, best of 5 underway. Kickoff goes in the Beyond Tactic Zone, Chirp off the corner. Good clear from Static. Just missed. I think those are the type of goals that Neon Tactics will benefit from. Just those random open looks. Or even just throwing the ball on net from anywhere. While BD United's in uh, rotation. Cole throwing that down. Good save from Io. Static clears it away. He's going to pick it up. Unfortunate miss. Reverb around the corner. Throws up off high. Stack could not get to it. Kiffy with the clear. Challenged by IO. Reverb looking for a follow up touch there. Did not get it. Goal! 
And Io puts it away. Miss from Cole. Io keeps it high over Kiffy. 1 0 beyond tactics. 341 left here. Game one action. Good challenge from Reverb. Unfortunately, they couldn't keep it in. Stack around one. Cole back. Gets her. Reverb around Chirp. Pops it up. Good D from Kiffy. Io keeps it in. Not sure if that was going in, but Chirp credited with the shot. Or with the save. Beyond Tactics has had most of the offensive pressure this game. Keeping United just in their own zone. Great pass, great pass, great pass from Chirp. Static puts that away. In United Zone, that's a good pass from Reverb. I couldn't do anything with it. Can you now do something on this attack? Not off that fake from Cole. Cole finds a post. Cole has not played for Clangers in the past, so... Fifty seconds to go. Looks like Beyond Tactics is going to take this one. If he finds a crossbar. And Reverb just taps that in. Three nothing Beyond Tactics. As a double digit seed, this is exactly what you want to do, is just come out here, punch the favorite in the mouth. United going to have to make some sort of change. So beyond tactics, take game one. Well deserved, uh, well deserved uh, game win there. Like they just had, you know, 
majority of shots, pressure. Force United into some bad defensive whiffs. Came away there with the win, like well deserved. So United are going to have to uh, stop playing like the Rats on defense. And uh, have a cleaner back line there. Because Beyond Tactics have shown that they will punish that. Game two. Ah, uh, yes, nothing says we need to change everything up by switching to scarabs. I know Cole has this preset ready because he showed it last week. I did not realize Kiffy had that. So United strike first here in game two. Kiffy gets that ball around the defender. Cole bangs it home. Puts it in. Cole. Manages to get a touch. Could keep in by reverb. I will assume reverb is broadcasting their point of view. So they did provide their uh, Twitch channel. Sending that in. Semi dunks the defender. Dangerous challenge there from Cole as the last person. Team clear. Choke to Cole. You've heard round one. Gets demoed after that air dribble. That's this point. Good save from static. IO flicks it up high. If he saves reverb shot. And IO finds a post. Static almost with the dunk there too. from static sure return to sender Cole on the follow-up sharp just puts it high that's why he's shooting like me play from reverb there trip gets it out or tries to good save from chirp Beyond tactics, swarming. And some probably questionable defense there from uh, United. And Io puts it away. Tie game, 136 left here in game two.
Man, Beyond Tactics just doing a good job keeping this ball in again, just like game one. Nice pass out to Reverb. Kind of shorted that just a little bit. I like the idea. United just can't get the ball away for any uh, any downtime whatsoever. I say this as they try and start an attack. Looks like we might have overtime here in game two. Chirp, round one. What a save from Reverb. Ball touches down. OT. Nice block from Cole and Reverb, but ball is away, static. Trying to center. Good 50 there from Static. IO flicks up high. Two defenders there. Good patience there from Static. Cole with the uh, tactical whiff. Chirp misses. Good save from Static. Defender could not get in the way of Kiffy's shot. Kiffy ends it 102 in overtime. Tie series. That was a nice try for Mayo. So Beyond Tactics looks like they're making a roster switch here. So, where I go, Cole? So, Matan replacing Io. Cole still on the scarab. And reverb there. Pinches it off Cole, I believe. Yep. So, Beyond Tactics. Up five. Or up one. Five seconds into game three. I know numbers and stuff.
So I don't think United need to panic. They just uh, need to quit making these defensive mistakes. Cole, flip of doom. Reaver puts it in off the post. 2 nothing beyond tactics. 29 seconds in. Beyond Tactics right now looks like they want it more. Kiffy with a car switch to the skyline this time. Cole sends that in. Easy pickup for Matan. Drops it down. River gets it on net. Not sure if that is going in. Cole forced him to save. Static off the post. That was a great attempt there. Great save there though on the back end by Static. Trying to clear it out. Gets a pinch off of Cole. Kiffy there for the save. This was right, that was definitely in. That, clearing that away, what's Cole going to do? Center that. Fortunately, meeting of the minds on Beyond Tactics prevents them from uh, punishing Cole's uh, touch. Stack clearing that away, touch from reverb, try and cross up the defense. Stack keeping that in. Well, I've been saying it throughout this uh, series so far. Ball stuck in United zone. And Static. Good challenge there from Reverb. Static just puts it away off the semi-cherry pick. 3-0 Beyond Tactics. The game plan so far for Beyond Tactics is completely working out. by Cole. Stack keeping that ball in. Two United defenders cleared that ball to half field or the midfield. Probably wanted to say half court, but nice challenge there from Stack. Puts the ball up. Reverb. Beats two defenders. 4 nothing Beyond Tactics.
kind of love what Tactics is doing here. They're going for the series knockout blow. Going for the clips too. And Kiffy steals that from Chirp. Beyond Tactics on match point. I mean, again, they've looked like the better team. I mean, honestly, we could, you could make the case that this series should be over and that Beyond Tactics should have swept. Um, so yeah. United have their work cut out for them. And I'm really not sure how they're going to beat this Beyond Tactics team. Like, Beyond Tactics is deservedly up. So... And shocking. They have a double digit seed just beating the tar out of a high seed in the IGL playoffs. And oh look, it's a BBU team. So United looking to force a game five here, scoring first. Last time they scored first, they needed OT in Game 2 to beat Beyond Tactics. And allow me to put on my neutral hat here. I kind of like it that uh, Beyond Tactics is coming out here and punching United in the face. Please be only me. Well, I know Chirp is slumming it, pulling the gravity and hot spotting, I think. Chirp's had some crummy internet. Reverb almost put that one away. My Dan almost gets it static. My Dan almost put that away with uh, Chirp just uh, staring with his internet trubs. Reverb throws it on. Good save from Kiffy. Bring it in through the corner. Ball comes out in the middle. Reverb. Throws on net. Good save from Kippy. Static on the put back. Good save from Cole. Static keeping that in. Reverb. That would have been in the uh, playoff plays of the week. The plays of the playoffs. Forgot how IGL is doing the playoffs. Cole beat Static there. 2-0 United. I mean, I will say that second goal from United is a great way to... Uh, Tell your opponents, quit attacking us because we're just counting you. 
we'll see if that change anything changes anything for game five. Of course, Stack says, "I'll take that open net." Thank you very much. Two oh nine left. Two one in favor of United. Sure, but gets knocked off the ball. Giffy clearing that down. Cole throwing out net. Reverb with the save. Giffy trying to intercept. And questionable touch there from Cole. Stack tried to punish that too. Reverb on the pass through the corner to Static. Static buries in the net. We got a tie game. Beats Chirp. One thirty alert. Save from Chirp there. Stack. Off the top of the net. Dan couldn't get that. Minute warning. Stack sending that in. Kiffy. Good back wall defense. Couple United players removed from the field. What a shot! Far down and in. Good center from Reverb. Matan buries it. United got 32 seconds to figure out their season. Now they got 29 seconds and they need two to get to overtime. Off the kickoff. Weaver buries that in the open net. Chirp. Gets around reverb, Kiffy buries it. 16 seconds, there's a chance. Defense kind of sold out there. I mean, they had at least one to give, so can't necessarily blame them. Ah, the solo queue kickoff there from United. We're in the countdown. United need to go the length of the field. Ball is still up. I mean, Beyond Tactics deserves that. Like, they were the better team. They outplayed, they outplayed United. Like, you know, based on these four games, it's one, it's amazing what three weeks will do. Um, but, you know, whatever they had planned for this game, like, you know, they executed it to perfection, came away with the dub. Like, you know, Again, well deserved to be on tactics for the victory. Let's uh, pay out some channel points.
So your recap, Beyond Tactics took the first game, 3-0. Uh, United won in overtime in game two. Uh, Beyond Tactics took game three, four to one. And came out there in game four with the victory. And yeah. Oh, you're welcome, Stack. GG's. Well deserved. You know, so now United, well, off season time. Time to reflect. Uh, but beyond tactics, 12 seed. They advance to round two. They're going to get the winner of either the four seed slot sus or the 13 seed provoked esports. But um, yeah, like. That's a great series. That's a great series from Beyond Tactics. Like, you know, just out, just outplayed United. Again, you could probably make the case that they should have won game two. But, you know, still. Come away with the uh, series dub. Got the, the mythical momentum heading into round two. Like, good luck. Go make some noise. You know, they adhered to the first rule of uh, IGL, show up. And, uh, <laughs> wow, show up they did. So, that will go ahead and do it for tonight. I don't think we have anything else on the docket. Um, who's live? You know what? We will throw it over to Abacus, who's... Casting... Playoff matches, I hope. So, everyone? Uh, thank you so much for coming out, and we'll see you all next time. Hopefully we'll have some matches next week. Have a good one, everyone. Hey, BBU coming in with a big raid of eight. How are y'all doing tonight? About 20 minutes. We'll have Radiance Amber versus Radiance Purple. We're just messing around until then.